Hi Libra, it's Ellie. Welcome to my channel and welcome to your reading. Now let's begin. I've already cleansed the space and I've meditated on the cards. This reading is good for your sun, moon, rising, and Venus signs. And if this reading resonates for you, please give this video a thumbs up and then leave a comment down below how it resonated for you. I want to say thank you to each and every one of you who has liked, shared, and subscribed to my channel. Thank you so much for supporting me here on YouTube. And thank you for supporting other tarot readers on YouTube as well. I'm now accepting personal readings, so if you are interested in booking a personal reading with me, all you have to do is click on the link in the description box down below. Libra, your overall energy for this reading is the Wheel of Fortune. Right. The Ace of Pentacles. Wow. The Sun. And then the Six of Swords. Okay. The Page of Pentacles, the Queen of Wands, you could be dealing with a Leo, all right, and then the Knight of Pentacles, all right. Underneath the deck is the Fool card, so either you're traveling or you're planning to travel, with, also with the Six of Swords, the Wheel of Fortune, these are all travel cards as well, more so the Fool card. A brand new chapter awaits for you. And this is something I'm getting you're excited about. You're excited about this new chapter, this new life you're you're about to to step into. I love it. I love this. I'm getting you're excited even if you feel like you're starting from scratch. Alright, take it how it resonates. Take it how it resonates, all right? But with the Wheel of Fortune, lucky turn of events for you, you see things that you've been trying to manifest for the longest time to finally come in, all right? I'm saying longest, it's the Wheel of Fortune. It's um, destiny, it's divine timing. It doesn't come in whenever you want or it doesn't come in instantly as soon as you want it to. It takes time. But even if it takes time, it's something that's worth the wait for you. I'm getting someone new coming in. All right, someone new coming in. Uh, could be dealing with a Taurus. There's a lot of um, earth placements here. Also, very strong Leo strong Aries, or you could have those placements as well. Not just about love, but also money as well. Really good um, turn of events for you regarding your career, your money. Um, you could be getting a promotion or you could be, you know, getting a new job or starting a new job. Maybe that's the new chapter that's uh, awaiting for you. Take it how it resonates, right? But uh, a lot of luck. I have to tell you, a lot of luck on your side. With Ace of Pentacles to the Page of Pentacles, again, Aces bring news and, no, Pages bring news and Pages bring new. Also Aces. This is something that you've been asking for from the universe, the right love. And I'm getting you've been asking that you want something new. Not someone from your past. All right. Um, this starts off as, a cup of coffee, a coffee date, you know, maybe you grab a few lunches with this person or see a movie. Maybe this person or you, maybe this person sends you something at work, sends you lunch, sends you like a slice of cake, or maybe you're going to do it. I don't know. Just this is, this starts off as something very cute and small and new and just fresh. All right with the ace of pentacles this is something that the universe has gifted you 
it's actually something stable and secure. Although it starts, you know, very quirky, very cute, it actually builds up to something very stable. Also in their money, I'm really getting your money is on point, all right? Or this new career you're starting is something really good for you. Abundance with a sun card, best card in the de in the tarot deck. Everything that you've ever wanted finally comes in for you or something even better, all right? A lot of abundance, happiness, and joy. You're very magnetic during this time and attractive. But other than that, if you're looking for someone, you will find someone attracted to you and you will find this person equally attractive as well. One thing about this person that you notice is not, not just about how gorgeous they are, male, female, it's not really a gender specific reading looking at the energies but it's not just they're, that they're gorgeous on the outside they're very sexy what adds to it is that you find them so driven and ambitious and so forward and uh, fierce like uh it's hard to look away it's hard to look at in a, at the other direction this is someone who just catches your attention because of it This is someone who is in the spotlight as well. All right, but a lot of joy, a lot of happiness coming in your way. And I'm really getting this person notices you. If you can see, the queen is looking at the knight. This person notices you. Okay. With the six of swords to the knight of pentacles. Yeah, you're ready to offer you're stable and secure love. You're someone who's financially and emotionally stable. You're very balanced, Libra. And you're ready to head on to something calmer, to something more peaceful, something more tranquil. I'm getting, you've gone through rough waters in the last maybe six months. But this is something that's worth it. This is something that's worth it. If Whatever happened to you in the last six months, it really rocked you. It really rocked your, your foundations. But uh, it has gone, you have got, become stronger because of whatever it is that you've gone through. Peaceful times ahead for you. All right. You're ready. You're ready for something new, something stable. All right. All right. If you hear that, those are my two dogs playing in the background. Um... I don't know what they're doing. Anyway, good spread. What's the outcome? All right, the nine of pentacles. The ten of pentacles. And then the queen of swords. Advice for you. King of Wands underneath the deck. You have the King and the Queen. All right. So this is a divine. This is a perfect match. This is a divine divine counterpart that's about to come into your life. That I'm really getting. I'm I'm getting. I'm connecting to a Libran who has fire placements as well. All right, male, female, it's not really a gender specific reading. All right, you have the Nine of Pentacles, the Ten of Pentacles, and then the Queen of Swords. You're not going to be single for too long, from the Nine to the Ten. Money is on point, career is on point, life is balanced and stable. And you're not going to be single for too long. If you've recently been single, you're not going to be single for any. For anything i mean for for too long from the nine to the ten you're going to meet someone you are supposed to be destined uh, you're destined with someone you're meant to be with someone you're meant to have a long-term stable commitment with and i'm getting 
It will be clearer for you with the Queen of Swords. It will be clearer for you. If before you had very clouded decision of what you would do or how you mo would move forward with e either about love or your career or your finances, it will be clearer for you. It will be clearer to you. You know how to move forward. All right. The advice for you, the Hierophant, the Queen of Pentacles, and then the Tower. All right. The Hierophant here, have faith. Have faith. And if there's a need to, you know, go back to school, not like school, school, my... Maybe you need to learn, take a course or two for your new job. Just go ahead, all right? With the Queen of Pentacles, focus on... <coughs> Sorry, if you heard that. If you heard that, those are my two dogs. Um, Queen of Pentacles. I'm getting, you know, love finds you. You don't have to search for it. You don't have to look so, you know, you don't have to look for it. You don't have to search for it. You don't have to hold on so dearly to it. The right love will come to you because what is meant for you will never pass you by. And then the tower card. There are still old remnants from your past that are needing to fall away or fall off from you. Just let it fall off, right? Stop holding on to it. Just let it fall off. Let's see other messages. You have new beginnings. All right. You have new beginnings. All right, judication. There is a decision that you have to make. It's always up to you. But whatever it is, it's going to be, it's going to make you abundant. It's going to make you more peaceful. I'm getting within yourself. And all right. There's no need to worry, all right? Everything will work out for you. There's no need to worry. So that's all I have for you, Libra. I hope something in this reading resonated, and if it did, please give this video a thumbs up, and then leave a comment down below how it resonated for you. I love you all so much. I'll see you in the next reading, and stay blessed.